talked a bit on this show about the ways that the media has sort of ignored Andrew Yang. They've left him off of graphics. They left him out of segments. Um, there's a new twist in this. <laughs> MSNBC actually got his name completely wrong. So, okay, Sagar. Andrew Yang is polling above yeah. Cory Booker. Yes. Above Beto O'Rourke. Yes. Two, <laughs> two, two United States senators, three United States congressmen, um, and they governors, him John the mayor of New York Yang. City. Um, yeah, John like Yang. Like, you can't make it up. I, so this particularly annoyed me. This is a point by uh, Zed Jelani, a friend of the show. Uh, he, he, he pointed out that the Asian Americans in this Democratic race have just been totally ignored. So nobody ever talks about Kamala Harris's Indian heritage. I mean, you know, she's half Indian. Yeah. Nobody talks about Andrew Yang. I mean, he's literally getting left off debate graphics. He's getting identified as Gabbard, John Yang. Tulsi Gabbard, the only discussion of her heritage is, uh, you know, some smears on her uh, on her religious upbringing, despite the fact that she's one of the only Hindu members of the United States Congress. And it's, 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 it's a bias that is consistently annoying because it presents race in America as a black and a white issue. Right. And if, if the Democrats want to embrace all this identitarian people of color language, then they're completely leaving Asian Americans out of that story. And I say this as somebody who's Indian, this is part of the reason why I embrace a much more nationalist American label, which is I think that 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 black and white discussion is so erasing of all the gradations in our in our American society that it's really it's just troubling for the way that we talk about it. Yeah, things. and look, I mean yeah. to be fair, like it's hard to tease out what's just like an accident, yeah. you know, some producer it keeps screwed happening. up. It's it, over it and keeps over happening and over. over and over yeah. again. And it does play into yeah. this sort of stereotype of Asians who are behind the scenes, right? Yeah. They're not supposed to be in leadership. They're supposed to be the ones like developing the new technology, mm -hmm. writing the code, et cetera, behind the scenes. And so when you have this individual, Andrew Yang, who, you know, has really different vision for America, really bold ideas, things that should be front and center in any national debate, and they just don't even know. Just don't care. One of our major national networks doesn't even yeah. get his name right. John it's Yang. Insane. John Yang. John Yang. I, yeah, so John is polling a lot higher than a lot of other people that that show <laughs> might know. So By the way, on Twitter they say John yeah. Yang is gonna give you a thousand and one dollars a month. So <laughs> even more. Maybe Bitcoin. you should support that guy. All right. We'll see you guys later. <laughs>